hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that uh, how to display google maps inside your tpinter application so basically this is a demo of the application we will be building here you can see we can display google maps inside our tweakinter application so it's a google map here so you can use google maps api which is integrated so it, it is completely free you don't need to get any sort of api key you can able to display google maps here so you can also zoom in you can see that at a specific location here you can see that if you want to there are also controls out there which uh, which enables to which helps you to zoom or zoom out at a particular location you can also drag and to a particular location here like this like this here you can see that So these are uh, different controls out there which is zoom and zoom out and also guys you can also place markers on the map as well you can see this is a red marker which is placed here this is a location Wellington, Wellington city in New Zealand you can see that this is a marker here if you want to go on to that location you can see that so you can go to into this location zoom in here you can see that so it is showing all the locations here inside your tokenter application so this will be the application guys that we will be building here try to build so it requires uh, 10 to 12 lines of code in python so i have given all the source code in the video description i have written a complete blog post where you can copy paste the source code so for building this guys we are using a dependency which is called as tweakinter map view so basically it's a component library which enables to embed google maps inside uh, your uh, tweakinter application basically it's a kind of a widget you can see it's open source it is uh, made by a specific person here and uh, it has got a great documentation but in this example i will just show you a very basic overview on how to use this library inside your tweakinter application so now if you have python installed guys you need to first of all install python on your machine so if you have python installed make a app.py file and right here inside your root directory just install this dependency which is tweakinter map view this is the package which is required for this dependency cls uh, so after do uh, after this guys what we need to do is that uh, let me copy this inside here let me write this code step by step how to do this so first of all guys after you install it you need to import the tweakinter library at the very top so after importing the tweakinter library we will import this library which is from tweakinter map view we need to import tweakinter map view this line signifies that we are importing this library here so after that guys we need to initialize our window tweakinter window we can give a width of 500 by 500 and also we can give a title to it of google maps and now guys we need to display the map inside window so now to display the google map it's very easy we will declare the widget here so we will now use tweakinter map view and here we need to display it inside our root window put a comma and this is the width of the map this is 600 and the second one is height you can control all these parameters guys this is the width of the map this is the height of the map the third parameter is uh, the corner radius you can also control the corner radius as well this time I will just give it zero and then basically I will pack it on the screen I will fill it from both locations so this needs to be in double quotes and expand parameter to be true 
So now if you run this application, you will now see some kind of map displayed on your machine. Uh, oh, I haven't uh, uh, initialized the window. So root t main loop. So this will have the quick enter win window initialized. So now guys, you have these controls out there plus minus. So all these controls are there. So our map is not showing. So now to show the map, it is very easy. We need to first of all set the Google URL. So this will be map widget dot set tile server. This is the method we will need to call. And here you need to paste this address, which is for the Google map. Let me paste this address. So this is the address guys that you need to paste in the uh, web, uh, video description you will find out all the source code and the second parameter it takes is the zoom level maximum zoom so here you can provide any value i will provide 22 and lastly guys uh, if you now uh, look here now you will see the google map is showing here you can see that you can zoom out of the google map this is a google map here you can see that so now to place the marker at a specific location guys at a specific country it is very easy to do you don't need to require any sort of coordinates such as latitude longitude so you just need to type the address let's suppose i want to uh, place a marker on india country in a particular state so basically what I will write here, uh, there is a method out there uh, in which you can set the location map widget. So set underscore uh, address here. You need to simply pass the full location. So location can be anything. This can be uh, Uttar Pradesh. There is a city in India, which is Uttar Pradesh. Sorry, this is a state. India that's it so if you type like this also then it will also recognize the location that's the beauty of it so you don't need to uh, uh, provide the latitude longitude of a particular location you can just type the name and then it will automatically recognize the address and now if you run this application it will exactly pinpoint you can see Lucknow is the capital of Uttar Pradesh so it is pinpointing the location which is it is there inside India you can see that right here similarly you can have any state or city inside the world let me take Tokyo Japan so once again if I now run this so now it will place exactly you can see at Japan here you can see that where it is Japan so it makes it very much easy guys to display Google Maps and place markers on the exact location. So if you have exact location, let me put uh, Lakshmi Nagar, Delhi. This is, let me, I think it's a full address. You can see that how it is taking the full address. You can see Lakshmi Nagar Vikas Mark, you can see. You can also write uh, very detailed addresses as well. So if you don't want to write city name, you can even write uh, full address and it will pinpoint the address. You can see that how it is. So I think it's a great application. You will definitely enjoy it by building it. So I think uh, you can see how much less code is required. Only 10 12 lines of code is there and you will be able to make your own google maps inside your twinter application you can see here so if you like this video guys then please hit the like button subscribe the channel as well and uh, i will be seeing you in the next video thank you very much